Good morning and God bless you. Today I'm going to continue to speak about how to share Jesus Christ, how to share the love that you have for him. And today I'm going to give you something real simple to do in about three minutes or less. Today when you go out into the world, we're gonna call this stepping outside of the pew. We're gonna have you go out today when you buy your coffee, uh, when, you, when you're in the store checking at the checkout line, I just want you to say one simple thing when you look, meet somebody. Just, just start with this. Just look at somebody and say, God bless you. And before you go into that store, I want you to pray. Pray, say, Father, give me the courage to tell people who you are in me. If you've accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, he has come to live in you. Imagine that. A home fit for a king. He's in you. He lives in you. And the reason he lives in us is because he wants to love people through us. That's all we're supposed to do as Christians is love. Is love. That's God is love. And we ought to love. And how do we show that love? Well, we start by looking at people and we ask our Heavenly Father to bless them. Somebody doesn't have to sneeze for you to say, God bless you. So look at them today and say, God bless you. Have a blessed day. You will be amazed at what this leads to. You know, I was recently um, in a store and I said this to a woman. I said, God bless you. And she looked at me and she said, he has blessed me. And I said, really, how so? And she said, well, I go to mass, Sunday mass. I go to Saturday night mass. I belong to the same church, I tithe. And I said, that's awesome. I said to her, I said, do you read the Bible? She says, oh no, I don't have a Bible. And I said, let me get you one, I'll get you a Bible. <laughs> this is why I love to speak with people at their place of work. It's great because I'm a customer. You need to treat me right, okay? But I'm coming in and I'm coming in with the love of Jesus and when I look at you and I say, God bless you, you never know what that's gonna, what's gonna happen. Some people will look at you and say, well, God bless you too. And I'll say, thank you very much. He has blessed me. Sometimes people will look at you and say, whatever, dude. <laughs> but just start by saying God bless you. This will lead to so many things. Um, something else you can do. And again, you need to be praying about this. You need to be praying that God would fill you with the, to be bold and to, and to have courage and to share the name of Jesus. Because you know, in our own flesh, in our, in our, in within ourselves, we, we don't wanna be bothered. We're too busy, we're trying to get here, get there. That's what the world is, but we are called to express the love of Christ everywhere we go. So, something else you can try, if you're standing in line, maybe at your local coffee shop, be praying, be praying for that person in front of you. And if God says, buy their coffee, buy their coffee, buy them a coffee, and they'll turn around and they'll look at you and say, why did you do that? And I'll say, well, because Jesus loves you. Jesus loves you. Do you know how much I just wanted to do it? And God bless you. You have a blessed day. You see, we're saying the name. I was also recently, I have so many testimonies, it's unbelievable. Uh, I was recently in a store and there was this uh, young girl and she was talking to her boss, I think, and she was talking about how um, her car was broken and she needed some money to fix it. And I just felt, Jesus, he said to me, he said, he said, John, he said, John, you pay for it. So I went to my ATM, I ran to the back of the store, I slid the card through the ATM, and I couldn't get the money. But then I kept sliding it, and I got some money. <laughs> and I gave her the money, and I went over to her, and, and, and I looked at her, and she said, can I help you? I said, you know, I just want to tell you. Jesus loves you and I gave her the money 
and she started to cry and the next thing you know we're standing in the middle of the store and we're hugging and she's crying <laughs> and she said I've been praying to God for days for years he doesn't hear my voice you know come to find out her she told me her sister had committed suicide right around Christmas time and I prayed I said oh Heavenly Father I said God Show your love, Lord. Fill her with the power and the peace of the Holy Spirit of Jesus Christ, Lord. I ask today that this child accept you into her heart. It was amazing. And you know, I went back there a few days later and I gave her some phone numbers of some women, um, spiritual women that I know that she could call. And I'll go back there again this week and I'll, I'll put a little more water on my flower as it grows in Christ. It's so awesome, man. Just so awesome. Well, you all have a blessed day. And uh, keep watching these videos. And uh, if you have any questions, um, I'll put an email address up at the end here where you can uh, send me an email. My name is John. I'd love to talk with you. And I'd love to hear about your, your amazing testimonies as you go out today and share Jesus Christ.